everybody. Welcome to MT Guitar. Today we have a request for Baby Baby by The Vibrators. And uh, it's a great uh, punk rock song that's got some nice guitar parts that are accessible for um, most levels. So let's zoom on in and get started. All right, so the intro has two guitars layered. And the first one is very distorted. And of course I'm using an acoustic and please feel free to use an electric. The notes are exactly the same. So there's two guitars doing the same part. The first one is quite distorted and it goes on a C sharp minor, ninth fret bar chord of a minor chord. Okay. And you're gonna do with the right hand, sixth string, fifth string, third, fourth. Then we go down to an A bar chord, and we do the same thing. Sixth, fifth, third, fourth. And every time we go to a different chord, we actually kind of want the slide sound, because that's what's happening in the recording. All, right. All down picks, because this is punk rock, you got to do down picks. On the, on the next chord after the A is B, two frets up. And the right hand is a little bit different here. It's six, five, five, four, three, four, five, six. And then slide up. So. Let's do it all. And you slide in on a at the last minute. So a little slower even. So that's the intro. Both guitars, clean and distorted, are doing that part. There's some little fills, and that first little little fill is 12th fret first string, 9th fret second string, and then they do a little 11th fret half note bend. Maybe a little bit of that third string 11th fret bend, pull off 9th fret 11th fret. You know, just standard pentatonic stuff. Which leave a comment if you'd like to cover that, if you'd like me to cover that. Okay, so that's the intro. Then we have the verse, and it's all power chords. So don't be doing a lot of open strings unless you want to stray from the recording, which is totally fine as well. But to, to stay to the nature of the song, all these chords will be power chords, meaning uh, the three strings, the three bass strings. The E chord, you can't open it up because th they, I think they do do that. Oops. Okay, so uh, you have the, the verse starts on A, all down strokes, eighth note pattern, du, 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 du. and then E chord, it's so pretty, and then B chord. Okay, and that keeps going. Now there's a second guitar part, so that, let's just do all that first, the, the, the main rhythm guitar. During those three phrases, there's another guitar part up here that I did during the intro that's worth looking at. Okay, pretty cool, right? So those are triads up in the frets here. We have an A triad, ninth fret, first string, tenth fret, second string, ninth fret, third string. Right hand picking pattern, first string, second, third, and then just a regular E bar chord here with not much uh, going on. And then a two frets up from this triad, a B triad, 11, 12, 11. First, second string, second, third, first, second, third. Okay, so you know, you can throw that in as a fancy little thing. Or if you're playing it with a band, you, you know, one person can do that, the other person can do this. Now, after three phrases, the fourth phrase is different. So here's the second phrase. Just wanna. Now a C sharp minor, and then and then the same thing. Uh, so C C sharp minor, A to B. 
that leads us to the chorus. C sharp minor A to B chorus. Okay, got that. Now the chorus is uh, E A and B, a classic one four five. But we want to do it in bar and power chords. And then we have a fill. So. That's the fill there. It's important to get that slide. So you're doing a fourth fret, fourth string. Slide up two frets and you hit it twice. Slide it back twice and then second fret, fourth fret, fifth string, and then you play, you repeat the uh, chord pattern. A little cleaner. Slower. There you go. There's the chorus. Remember to practice slow if you need to. Then the verse and chorus repeat, and the guitar part is exactly the same. <clears throat> then we have a solo, and the solo is a bit too long for this video. If it's something you really do want to learn, I will transcribe it, um, no problem. But for now, just know that the, the intro is the solo, meaning the intro chord progression is the solo progression. Right? All that cool, those cool licks. That's a lot of pentatonic, C sharp minor pentatonic. Pentatonic. Okay. So there you go. And then um, it goes back to the chorus after the solo. And then you kind of just go, you know, you play the chorus until the end. So have fun with this. And there you go. All right. You got this great song under your belt. So uh, go ahead and subscribe to MT Guitar. And don't miss out on the daily guitar lessons. Leave a comment if you'd like. And happy practicing, everybody. We'll see you next time. Bye.